Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be doing a vlog. I'm gonna do a day in life vlog by myself, no kids. I'm in the bathroom right now because I have my purse. I'm literally about to run out the door. It's about nine o'clock right now and I'm in my bathroom because I wanted to show you this makeup look. I didn't film it, but I wanted to show you the products I looked, I used and Waylon is upstairs running around. He beat me to the door. Um, he's staying here. He's going to be um, babysat, but I'm going to go. I have a couple errands to run real quick. Let me show you the makeup I used before I head out the door. And before we get this video started, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, like this video, and turn on your bell notifications so you're uploaded every time I upload a new video. Okay, so before we run out the door, this is Waylon's toothpaste. <laughs> I try to use a different one, but that was just the one that we had on hand. Um, that's my beauty blender back there. And then I used the Too Faced Peach Perfect Bat Foundation. I used the Lancome, I hope this focuses, the Lancome Primer. I used the um, Too Faced Bronzer and I think Chocolate Soleil. And then the Tarte Blush in the shade Feisty. This is a sample size, but I've had it for so long, it's so big. And then this um, is in Champagne Pop, the Becca Highlighter. Some Laura Mercier Powder. Some um, Tarte Hydra, is it the Hydro Concealer? And I want to say it's in the shade Light. And then this is the Benefit ba Bad Gal Bang Mascara. And then for lips, I'm using these two. Um, a MAC Lip Pencil and a NARS or a Bite Beauty Crayon. The pencil is in Dervish. And I'm sorry this is not focusing. And then the Lip Crayon from Bite Beauty is in Pulse. I don't have the lip color on yet. I'm going to put that on when I get in the car because I'm going to stop and get something to eat first. So I'm going to put that in my bag. Don't buy my nails. They're really, really bad. But let's go ahead and run some errands. Guys, I know this is not the best angle, but it's the only thing that I have. Um, all of like the surfaces, I'm at a red light too. Um, all of the surfaces are so <laughs> rounded in my car. So this is the only way that I can really talk to you while I'm driving. Um, and obviously pay attention to the road but i just got out of my car appointment i have no idea what they did but they had to do something and <laughs> it was a recall on something so i got that taken care of and then now i am on my way to target um i'm gonna try to pick up some things i have to pick up a couple birthday presents for family members and I want to see if they have any like cute fall things for Waylon. I do want to get him some, want to get him some arts and crafts, but I want to get like fun like fall items for him or some baking stuff. Um, and then I'm going to try to go to Trader Joe's. I saw a lot of people post that they put out the, all of their fall things, like all of their fall food items. So I want to try to get some stuff from there. And then I might run to Ulta because I'm running really low on shampoo and some other stuff. So I think I'm going to run by Ulta as well and pick up some things, which I really don't need. But I also have a coupon to get a free foundation. So I know if I don't use it now, then I probably won't use it. And I think it expires soon anyway anyways so that's the plan for today it is 70 degrees out finally and it's 12 30 and it does not feel like 70 it still feels like maybe 60 um the humidity is like not here at all which is so nice um and we're supposed to get part of a hurricane i'm filming this on wednesday i think you guys will see this on friday maybe um either friday or like next tuesday but we're supposed to get the tail end of a hurricane um either late today or tomorrow i think so we're getting like the rain portion now um and it's like it's just like crappy weather you know that like dreary weather type deal so that's what we're getting right now um hopefully it doesn't get too bad but I think by the time that it gets to us, it won't be bad at all, at least I'm hoping. I've lived in Georgia for three years, almost four years, and we've only been knocked out 
for I want to say it was like a week and a half like with no power and nothing for um, and it was only one time so I'm hoping that this year we definitely um, are fine I know that you know coming from Florida and everything I know how serious they can be and like my heart goes out to all of you that are going through it right now in Louisiana and Alabama um, but I'm just hoping everyone stays safe and we can all get through this year this is going to be a crazy crazy hurricane year for sure Okay, so I just got out of Target. Literally just put the card in and walked in the car. Um, that was pretty successful considering I only spent $60 and 20 of it was for birthday presents. Um, the unsuccessful thing is the rest of the stuff I got was like junk. <laughs> like I literally got cake mixes, I got sprinkles, I got icing, I got caramel popcorn. <laughs> nothing nothing I really needed but I definitely want to try with Waylon I want to um, make some really cool things with him and see how that goes I also got him a little um, what did I get him I got him a little book and I got him a little coloring thing and I'll show you the rest of the stuff when I get home and I'll show you like the little birthday present I got I almost like forgot how to shop for a two-year-old I mean Waylon is still two he turns three in a couple months but it's like now I feel like he plays with such older toys that I kind of like forgot what he played with when he was still in between like one and two so it was so funny trying to shop but I think now I'm on my way to Ulta and then I'll go to Trader Joe's they're actually right next to each other so it's not that bad um, but I'm, it's starting to rain so I'm hoping that I can get in and get out while I can um, so let's see what we can find at Ulta and hopefully I don't spend as much money as I normally do um, Ulta is definitely my weak spot okay we got the goods I know this seems like it's turning into a car vlog but it's just hard to like vlog in the stores um just because i like i don't know everyone is so like oh right now like when i went into ulta i love ulta but it was like more extreme than usual like can i help you can i help you can i help you don't touch this don't touch that so i was like oh so i didn't even bother trying to film in that but I don't know where I put my phone. I'm so tired, you guys, like legit, I'm exhausted. But real quick, while we're sitting in the parking lot, let's do a little Ulta haul. So the first things, a lot of this is like repurchases and then I got one free thing because of my status with them. Um, so I got two extra tanning mitts. These are the um, Saint Tropez. These are the double sided, um, the dual sided velvet applicator mitts. So I got two of those because I go through those so quick. Um, another repurchase was this Way leave in conditioner. Um, this is truly a godsend. And then I, the only reason why I went into Ulta was to get some more shampoo. Um, this is the Redken Color Extend Blondage Shampoo. Um, I like it. it, it really, really works and it's a reasonable price. It's only like 20 bucks, I think. Um, 
Then I got, this is a new one. Um, I see a lot of people on Instagram talking about this. It's the Laura Mercier, the Pure Canvas Primer. Um, this is the blurring one. So I can't tell if my camera is shaking. But this is the, um, the blurring primer. I wanna say it's in the white bottle or the pink bottle, but I wanted to go ahead and try this out because I like a blurring primer, but the only like blurring-ish primer I have is the Benefit Cosmetics, like the pore filling one. So I wanna try something different because um, I feel like that one dries out my skin just a little bit. And then I also got this primer. Um, this is from Smashbox. I kind of forgot I got this one. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay um this is the photo finish vitamin glow primer i thought this one would be really good um when it starts to get um pretty dry outside so my face doesn't dry out and then um this is the free thing that i got it is the clinique beyond perfecting foundation it's like the two-in-one um this has been around forever but i it was either this or like the hemp lotion that I could get for free so I ended up with this one I hope this is not too dark um I got this in the shade buttermilk like that's the color of it so I'm hoping it's not too dark um if it is a little bit too dark then that's fine I can always I, I can always do it but I just hope it's not like extreme um and then the last thing I got these were on sale so I was like why not um, this is the Kylie lip kit. These were on sale for, I think $18 and I got the shade Coco K. Um, if you don't know what comes in the lip kit, it's the liquid lipstick and the lip liner. I don't think I've used her lip liners and it looks like a really, just a, your basic pink, just like a pinky nude. Yeah, this will be really, really nice. It's not like summery pink. Um, so that's nice. It's really mauvey. It would be great for fall. Um, so that is my little Ulta haul that I got. I hope you guys liked it. And I honestly, I have such a bad headache. I need to go get a Coke. I've been trying really well not to drink Cokes as much as I do. But when I like start to run my errands and stuff, and especially wearing a mask, I don't know what it is. Like neutral when it comes to whether you need to wear a mask or not um, I'm not gonna voice my opinions on here but I will tell you that I get a really bad headache from wearing a mask I just wear these the inside of it is covered with my makeup um, but just these like um, disposable ones um, just cuz that's like all I have so um, I wear these I don't know why it gives me such a headache it could just be like me running errands um, in general but yeah it kind of sucks but I'm not gonna like voice my opinion whether I need to wear one or not I'm gonna wear one when I'm told to and that's about it but yeah that was my little Ulta haul so I'm gonna try to go to Trader Joe's I'm on the hunt for some specific things I want to get I think they have an almond butter or like an apple butter and then their apple cider donuts um Waylon loves donuts so I really want to get some for him and then I think I might get like a pumpkin soup or like a pumpkin ravioli if they have it I'm not a huge fan I mean like I don't know if I'm a huge fan of pumpkin or not but I want to go ahead and try it but I've had their raviolis in the past like different kinds and I wasn't a fan so maybe I'll just stick to like a soup or something um but hopefully I can get in there hopefully it's not busy because they have you stand outside and it's raining so I don't know but yeah so welcome to my car vlog and then when I get home don't worry I'll show you everything when I get home too Alright, I am finally home. Sorry if you can hear the news in the background, but we are checking on the weather. Um, and I kind of wanted to give you guys a little overhaul of what I got today at Target. got these two things in the dollar section. This is like $3 and this was a dollar. Um, these are really cute little coloring. And then this is just a book. And then 
we are gonna start potty training. So I did get Waylon um, these underwear with Toy Store. I think these are so cool and he's so excited. And then I did just get some white bread because um, I made my own butter and I wanna try it. And then these, well baby, you can color it. And this I'm so excited for. This is the maple pecan caramel corn. Um, Archer Farms is like a Target brand, but I'm so excited to try this. They had other flavors, um, but this one wasn't as sweet. So I'm so excited to try that. And over here is just a little collective haul. Um, we have, I bought a whole bunch of broths and stocks um, to make in some fall recipes. Um, so I'm really excited. I stocked up on these and then I stocked up on just cream, like cream of onion. And then I got cream of mushroom soup and cream of chicken soup in the four pack. And then these, our stove is really dirty, so don't mind that. <laughs> I got a um, French vanilla cake, which I'm going to put this strawberry stuff and Nutella and make a, like a dump cake. And then the brownie mix. And how cute are these? I bought these little Halloween. Who remembers these? Everyone used to put them on their cake such a long time ago. And then I just got the frosting to go with it. I thought Waylon would love these. And so other people know that we're more than friends. And ever since you 